Hey everyone, we get a lot of questions about how and where we test products for candle science. Good news for you, I know a guy. Hello everyone, and welcome to the Candle Science Lab. This is where we test and develop all of our new and existing products, be it reed diffusers or jars for our ever-growing container line, fragrance oils, which are always in development, we test those in all of our bases, including melt and pour soap, as well as cold process recipes, and of course, candles. As you can imagine, we're always super eager to test fragrances once they arrive. So you'll find most of us with blotter strips as soon as we receive the oil. But as my fellow candle makers will know, the true test is in the finished product. So after it passes our initial sniff test, it's time to make some candles. And because consistency is so important, our lab techs follow very specific guidelines for candle size, wick size, fragrance load, as well as cure time. After that process, once the candle is made and cured and ready to burn, it's time to go to the fragrance booths. Our evaluation booths are one of my favorite parts of this place and a huge asset to fragrance development. Each one has a dedicated climate control and exhaust system. They're designed and built to isolate fragrance and control as many variables as possible. Our product development team consists of fragrance professionals and seasoned candle makers like myself, but we like to pull as many people from other departments for this step of the process to get as many opinions as possible. Fragrance development does take up a large chunk of our time here in the lab, but it is most certainly not the only thing that we do. We are constantly testing new waxes, new wicks, diffuser bases, soap recipes, as well as a variety of applications that we're excited to launch in the future. So be sure to check back here for more behind the scenes videos to see what we have going on here in the lab. Thanks for stopping by.